Hello everyone and welcome to Fingertips. Are you planning to move on the path to become a data scientist or is it you have finally backed an interview for it? But how are you going to prepare for the interview? Perhaps this video can help. This video brings you some important data science questions and answers to help you crack your interview. Data science interview questions are very different from any other technical interviews due to the nature of work that a data scientist perform you may be asked questions about anything ranging from statistics machine learning deep learning and data visualization so let's go to a virtual interview room and go through some basic data science interview questions hello nanya how are you hello sir i'm fine thank you Ananya, can you tell me what is data science? Yes, sir. In simple words, data science is making the raw data intelligent by using the concept of machine learning and deep learning. It analyzes data for actionable insights. Now, using this insight, we can know the taste of customers and predict the success of the product in the market. Right. Then, what is deep learning? So deep learning is an advanced version of neural networks to make the machines learn from the data. In deep learning the neural network comprise many hidden layers that are interconnected to each other and the output of the previous layer is the input of the current layer. Okay, now can you explain what is bias in data science? So bias is an error that take place in a data science model when an algorithm is not strong enough to capture the trends that exist in the data um in simple words it occurs when the data is very complicated and the algorithm is not able to understand it as a result a model is built that makes simple assumptions which may lead to low accuracy Now linear regression logistic regression are some of the algorithms that can lead to high bias. Well explain Ananya. Now can you give some insights into logistic regression? Sure sir. Logistic regression is a predictive analysis. It is used to describe data and to explain the relationship between one dependent binary variable and one or more independent variables. It just means a variable that has only two outputs the output can either be yes or no okay great can you tell me one example yes sir let's say suppose we want to predict if it will rain or not based on two factors that are temperature and humidity here rain is the dependent variable and temperature and humidity is the independent variable Another example of linear regression can be of predicting if the student will pass this exam or not based on the number of hours he studies. Okay, now can I ask you what is linear regression? So linear regression is a basic and commonly used type of predictive analysis. It is used to predict the value of a variable based on the value of another variable. The variable you want to predict is called the dependent variable. and the variable you are using to predict the other variable's value is called the independent variable now tell me what is the difference between data analyst and data science data analytics is just the subset of data science that needs basic programming languages in simple words it is just analysis of data to make decisions here the main aim is just to find solutions whereas Data science is a broad technology that includes many subsets like data analytics, data visualization, data mining, etc. For it, you need to know advanced programming languages. It not only helps to find solutions but also predict the future of the product with the help of the past patterns and insights. Overall, the goal of data science is to discover meaningful insights from massive data sets. Impressive Ananya. The most important question that is what are the popular libraries used in data science? So, few of the most popular libraries used for data extraction, cleaning, visualization and deploying data science models are first TensorFlow, 
that supports parallel computing with outstanding library management supported by Google. Next can be SciPy that mainly uses graphs and charts to solve data manipulation, visualization, differential equations, and multidimensional programming through graphs and charts. The third one is Pandas, which is used to implement the ETL, meaning extracting, transforming, and loading the datasets capabilities in business applications. Next popular library is Matplotlib, that is free and an open source. It can be alternative for MATLAB, which results in better performance and lower memory consumption. So guys, these were some basic data science interview questions for getting you through the interview process. However, this is just part one. In the next part, we will be discussing some advanced data science interview questions. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you like this video. To get an update on our next video, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. Till then, happy learning.